Hi, my name is Emily Chapman. I was born in Japan and grew up in New York. So I went to undergrad at Williams College, a small liberal arts school in Massachusetts. And when I was there, I actually didn't do pre-med at all. I was a political science major. After college, my first job was working at a VA hospital. And I was working with a medical team there and realized that I really wanted to pursue medicine. So from there, I uh, did a post-bac pre-med program at Columbia. Um, it took me a little time to get all the courses done, but then I enrolled, I applied and eventually enrolled at Mount Sinai for medical school. So I'm, I'm particularly interested right now in cerebrovascular neurosurgery. Um, and so, you know, ever since I was a medical student doing a scholarly year um, with the department here, I've really sort of uh, focused in on the cerebrovascular research center, both, you know, clinical and research, particularly research-wise. Um, and so it's been really great, you know, working under Dr. Mako, um, also working with Dr. Kellner, um, and you know, it's, it's really it's really great to have a, a sense of also the residents here who are interested in cerebrovascular neurosurgery, um, working on them on projects, and you know, I've learned a lot from them. Well, I've played soccer since I was like five, um, and you know, things we got busy with med medical school and college, but it's something that I've sort of kept up throughout the years. Um, I also really love backpacking and hiking. I've been also getting a little bit into rock climbing, um, getting into it a little more. I've been hiking since I was a little kid and um, as I've gotten older I've really uh, tried to push myself a little bit and backpack in like pretty cool places. When I was looking for a neuros neurosurgery residency program when I was applying, um, one of the most important things to me was to get lots of operative exposure and you know everybody talks about operative exposure but, but truly just being in the OR um, you know, having great teaching, but in a way that challenges me to, um, you know, get to the next level, whatever level of training I'm at, but to, to really improve my surgical skills um, and, you know, as well as increase my overall understanding of what needs to happen in the pre-op, intra-op, and post-op period. You know, what really stood out to me about Mount Sinai in particular was, given that it's a really big healthcare system, um, and they see a lot of patients every year in all the different subspecialties, I knew that I would get a lot of that clinical exposure, um, you know, by being on the service and then, you know, with particular subspecialties, I could pursue that even further.